children, I'm Monica and I'm going to do a yoga sequence with you called Cat Cow. You're going to like it very much. It'll help to strengthen your core, release any tension you might have in your back and helps you feel a little light and happy because you get to make sounds like a cat and like a cow. Hands, knees, Press the feet, tucking under on the exhale. I want you to squeeze your tummy in. And because we are a cat, say meow. And then arch, go moo. Keep going. This is like dancing cat. Good. And the other way. Excellent. Good. And now from your cat cow, let's do a stronger posture. Take the hands forward, hips forward, hips back. This one is called Up Dog, because your head is up, and Swan Pose, and I'm not sure why. Do you know why? I would like you to comment and tell me why. You breathe in and breathe out. And I know you are very strong. We can do a stronger option called Down Dog. Dog. And I want to hear you bark. Woof, 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 woof. I have two dogs that live here with me. They love to bark. And if they knew I was here doing up dog, down dog, they'd be doing it with me. Have you got a dog? What's your dog's name? Have you got a cat? What's your cat's name? <gasps> they are lovely names. Now we're going to wag our tail. On your hands, knees, you can lift it up and wag. But if you are stronger, because you might be having an injury, recovering from an injury, you can do all of the yoga postures at a softer place. So, the down dog, lift your tail, wag. Wagging, change legs, down dog, tail, wagging, woo! Knees sit back towards your heels and this is a very special pose because it's named after you. It's called child's pose. Relax, breathe. And sitting up. Child's pose is nice because it's relaxing, it's recovering. It's a place you can go to whenever you feel a little bit overwhelmed. Child's pose. We're going to do a very short meditation. Find a comfortable position. You can have your palms open. You can put a finger and thumb together. Or you can place your hands at your heart. Ask yourself, what would I like to do? You could even lie down. Yes, you can. Or sit in a chair. Or 
snuggle up with mum or dad or grandparent. Take some deep breaths. Good. When you send your breath down towards the base of your lungs, let your belly expand and keep breathing. And then when you breathe out, let your tummy press in. Good. A few more. Very good. A few more. Because I know I just said that, but I really do mean it. on your heart. Love. Love is all that you are. Send love to yourself. Say to yourself, I love you. And if you can, next time you look in the mirror, say, I love you. You are beautiful. You are wonderful. You are my best friend. Say that to yourself. I am wonderful. I am beautiful. I am my best friend. Yes, you can still have more best friends. Yes. Send that love to yourself, all through yourself. Sending love, sending love, wrapping yourself with love. And then zip up your energy. Release whatever you don't need anymore. Breathe in. Release. One more. Well done. Hands to heart. Namaste. Namaste means I see you. So when you say namaste to me, it means that you see me. Thank you for joining me. See you tomorrow.